Traditionally, macrophages have been difficult to study in real-time chemotaxis assays because the cells are slow moving. This protocol provides a means to image macrophages migrating in a chemotactic gradient for up to six hours or longer. Compared to endpoint assays such as transfer assays, this technique has the advantages that macrophage morphology can be observed and parameters such as cell velocity and chemotactic efficiency can be measured. Macrophages are involved in many inflammatory diseases and this technique can be useful to study drugs designed to inhibit chemotaxis. It can also be applied to other cell types such as human monocytes. When attempting this technique for the first time, it is best to practice filling the chemotaxis chambers before working with cells. One of the most important aspects of the technique is the avoidance of air bubbles. Start by pre-filling the connecting channels of one or two chemotaxis slides with modified RPMI 1640 HEPES medium, prepared according to manuscript directions. Place a slide into a cell culture dish and set the dish onto an aluminum block heated to 37 degrees Celsius. Then insert plugs into ports 1 and 4. Use a 200 microliter beveled pipette tip to deposit 15 microliters of the modified RPMI 1640 HEPES medium into filling port 3. Next, insert the pipette tip into port 2 and aspirate 15 microliters at a moderately fast rate. 